Hello friends, this is Ramana. Today I will show demo on string aggregate function. So, what this string aggregate function will do? So, string aggregate function it will take all expressions from all rows and concatenate the mm, with separator uh, like a, it will concatenate it will concatenate the values of the, the string expressions and places with separator values between them. So, string aggregate function is first introduced in SQL Server 2017. So, if you are using the um, SQL Server prior to the 2017, you cannot find this string aggregate function. This inbuilt function, this inbuilt string aggregation function will be um, will be available uh, after after 2017 SQL version. So the below is the syntax. Here the syntax is string aggregate function takes two parameters. First one is expression and second one is separator. And within the group, this is the from, uh, this is uh, second line is optional. Second line is optional. So within within the group is one of the statement. Uh, after within the group, you need to mention order by class with the expression. Second line is the purely optional. Uh, the, the, if you want to apply the string aggregate function, uh, in your column, you need to pass two parameters. These two parameters, first is uh, column name or expression, and second one is separator. Now, I will show how to do this in the in table. So, this is my table. This is <coughs> called some mm, name of the table is prescription. And here there are two columns, one is medicine name and one is daily usage. So first one is medicine name, medicine name, the, the medicine name which you can which the patient should use morning and at night. And this is the second medicine name which is supposed to be used by the patient in three times. Now I am applying string ag aggregate function first on medicine name and how the data will appear after applying the string aggregate function. I am writing the query. So now, string underscore aggregate function and here I am asking medicine name, medicine underscore name. I already told there are two, two parameters it needs to pass. One is expression and one is separator. So here I want to I want so if you want to put separator, then I am mentioning with like uh, separator I just type on and as as alias name and the result is my alias table name. Now if you view this coding, so it will appear like this. All a a e. A A A will come twice, B B B thrice, and C C C one one time, D D D and E like that. How many times it appear in the table? Um, it will all appear in the same, in the same with same count, but it will appear like as a string, which is given separator. If you want to change the separator? I want to mention this is it as a percentile. Percentile and, and, and run this query. Then the medicine name, each medicine name is separated by percentile symbol. Like this, the string aggregate function will work. We already discussed some second line within group order by class, which is optional. So, if you want to apply this uh, class within, uh, within group statement, within and mention in order by class order by medicine name order by medicine name DESC that means first FFF FFF -F 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 will come later G -E -E, D -D -D, like that it will come so we mentioned DESC as the result is the from the table so you need to write the within group class within group statement or order by class before the from class so if you execute this one the
the result will be start with the FFF. See here, FFF, FFF. So like that, you can get the uh, order by when you read the within group. You cannot make order by class alone without using the within group statement. So if you try to use, use this one, obviously order by class will come after after from class. So you need to cut and paste this after this one. And now if you execute this one, it won't work. It will throw error. This is how the, it will get the error. It is asking group by function like that again. So <coughs> if you want to get the uh, use the order by class, you have to mention the within within the group statement before the from 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 class. Now this part is over. Now. I am using the, as I mentioned earlier, medicine daily doses. Now I want to display the output should be in this way. How can I get the output? A A A is the medicine name. Afterwards, morning is the daily usage, comma, night as daily, and after. BBB so morning afternoon with comma separator and evening so I want I want this output like this in, in this way so uh, how can I get and how, where I can use this string aggregate function I am taking this entire table and first I am taking the medicine name comma using the string underscore aggregate string underscore aggregate and within the uh, within the expression I am taking it daily usage daily underscore dosage daily dosage the separator I want here the comma separator comma separator and <coughs> you see as you see and run this one it is asking the group by class because why because it's an aggreg aggregate function string uh, either aggregate function if you want to use the aggregate function you can use the group by class group by group by mention your column name column name see here my medicine name in one column that's first column and usage usage of medicine how many times the daily usage will in second column where I use the string aggregate function so I use the string aggregate function daily usage and with comma separator value so this is how you know to get the in earlier version we used to we used within group and we go, we can get the result, but at the time of the using the um, group by you, the uh, in select column, you have to specify the um, on which column you need to group by uh, apply the class. So that's why uh, I am taking one medicine name separately on medicine name. I am applying the group by class to get the desired result. So this is how you need to get the string aggregate function within the statement and as well as group by group by class so after group by you know to uh, mention order by as well it's 
a regular it's, uh, that doesn't make much, much difference order by DSC order by DSC means first we will take the FFF FFF D E E E E D D C B A like that this is how you can use the string aggregate function on your column of the of your table as per the as per your requirement but one thing you need to mention the expression parameter specifies uh, any expression that will be concatenated the separator parameter is used to separate the expressions that will be concatenated the order by class parameter is optional optional parameter and helps to order the concatenated expression and it must be used the order by class must be used along with within group step hope this video is understand something about the string aggregate function thanks for watching the video thank you very much